following is a theoretical explanation of Einstein's theory of relative simultaneity. Anna is riding on a railroad flat car that is moving east at, theoretically, close to the speed of light. In each hand, she holds a flashbulb, which she causes to flash at precisely the same instant. Bob is standing on the ground, watching Anna pass. We have two events, the flashes with different locations. Anna will see both light beams move at the speed of light, relative to herself, despite the fact that she, herself, moves over the earth. The flashes occur at equal distances from Anna's head, so the arrival of the light at Anna's head is a single event, with a single location, her head, and a single time. Bob sees the light travel at the speed of light, relative to himself. But according to Bob, Anna moves some distance to the east while the light beams travel. Therefore, the beam moving from the west flashbulb has farther to go. If Bob were to agree that the beams originated simultaneously, he would conclude that the beam from the east flashbulb will reach Anna first. This is a contradiction. A single event. The arrival of two light beams at the same time at a single location, and his head either occurs or it doesn't. The discrepancies between the observations of Anna and Bob may, at ordinary speeds, be extremely small, but the effect is real. Credits. Illustrated and animated by William Bowes. Special consultants. Kilo Tango and Charlie Bravo. Narrated by Stephen Hawking's more fluent brother. Score. Spend some time remixed by Immortal Technique. Full respect to the chair and illustration grads of 2009. I once knew a whose real name was William.